Hello everybody, and anybody out there, it's Drew Man, one, two, three, five, six, nine, nine. The last time we left off, you saw my finger pointing to what we're, our next objective is. Which is these jammers right here. So, just rebel and press the square button, and then destroy. Just go crazy on it. Uh... There we go, we got it. Ugh. Wow, we are being, like, seriously ambushed. Mr. Fantastic, why are you just standing there doing nothing? Did you guys see that? He was just standing there, just doing nothing. He, isn't, well, he wasn't moving or anything, he was just standing there, right next to this. Like, hey, I'm here. Oh, wait, hold on. I think I just remembered something. Yeah. You want to get this before we actually destroy the last one. Or you could clear it. I don't know. We'll see in a second if you could have just uh, destroy all of this and cleared the place. Yeah, you could have just waited until you cleared the area to then gone over there and gotten it. But anyways, there's one of the collective, collector things. And trust me, there's a lot of collectibles in this game. And we're going to have lots of fun getting them all. Don't even get me started on one simulation. Okay, next mission. I gotta check the book, see what I gotta do. Let's see where the first book is at. Okay, I'm tired, but I'm staying up all night tonight, so I can go to sleep tomorrow. Okay, I remember the silver. Or did I just put the remote? There it is. I lost my controller. Okay. You can destroy the computer for some extra, um, you know, stuff. I did not know I could do that. You can just destroy all of them. Or most of them, yes. Yeah, you can do that and destroy the computers. And you get extra, um, XP or whatever you want to call it. To use for your legging. Which I will use right now. Oh, okay. Yeah, I just picked up the strike upgrade for him, even though I know he's really strong, but he isn't actually that strong. Like, his super strength isn't really applied when using him. Anyways, though. Funny story about this level. When I was, when I was playing this level, I read the map backwards, because in the strategy guide, there's a little map of the area. And I was looking at the map backwards. So I was following the... I was going from the... I thought I was going from the end of the level to the beginning of the level. But uh, here's the doc, two documents right here. And info on the Scorcher. And then right here, which is info on something else. I don't know what. Wizard. Which is the two enemies we fought a little bit while ago. You, yeah, or uh, a couple of episodes ago, if you don't remember. Ow. And I actually know the side mission for this one. Okay, I didn't know I popped him up. I didn't mean to pop him up, but I didn't know. Even though I did, I didn't mean to. So, yeah. Um, as you can see, the Tinker has been experimenting on people in here. And you can destroy everything in here. Here's something. You see that? That was a guy. That's an actual person. That was brutal. But, where is he? Oh, it's not this room, is it? It's the next room. Okay. Let me check something real fast. Okay. There's gonna be, like, a lot of checking something real fast. In this game. In this let's play. Let's just do that. Because I don't feel like... Me smash everything. Okay, you see that right there? How there's an actual person in there or whatever? 
that is the side mission right there. I mean, part of the side mission. For the actual mission, you just gotta hit um right here. You gotta hit these things. Oh, I already hit that one. You gotta hit those things right on the side and to drop that claw down or whatever, which will make that overload. But here's the side mission. You want to hit this, so that way the, all the acid uh, liquid in this starts draining, and then you want to just kill the prototype guy, who is the person who jumped out. Whoa! Did you just see that box right over here glitch, like, super badly? Okay, that was really odd. Usually it doesn't glitch on me, this game. I mean, sometimes it does, but not a lot. And yes, it's a lot of, like, the seizuring glitches. Like, something is seizuring. Ah, there's a piece, person, I'm a, a piece, and there's a piece, and now the piece, and now there's a person at my school whose name is, uh, Caesar, or Caesar or something, and I just call him Caesar. I don't actually know the guy, I just know his name. But it's like that restaurant. I'm not gonna say any else, anything else about it. But you know which restaurant I'm suggesting if you. You probably know, because I just mentioned little Caesar or little, little, little seizures. Yeah, you get it? Get it, little seizures. Where is the restaurant that we eat? Um, says, oh, okay, never mind. I, look, I was looking at the map wrong. Here it is. You want the focus for Grim, I mean, uh, Ben, the thing, because obviously he isn't the most well focused person in the world. There we go. Prototype. Two down. Prototype. Three going right after him. Cool. Even though I just spent jump and slam, because I like the jump and slam. And everyone else probably has an upgrade, but I don't feel like spending on that. I don't feel it. Except for uh, the human torch. I'll spend his upgrades. Because the human torch is another one of my main team members. So, <laughs> but that's strange. It says in here. Oh, it just says X's. Oh, okay, I guess X's are the um. Main. Okay, never mind them. I thought there was something else in there other than the prototypes in those, but no, there isn't. That's all. And the door you want to go through is over here. If you watch the door, it would have exploded. And the door that explodes is the door that you want to go through. So. And there's our next prototype guy. Although, I probably missed the prototype guy in the last room. I'm going to go back and check that. You guys, uh, hold on the floor down there. You got this. No, I didn't. Okay, never mind. I'm an idiot. Um, in team-oriented games, you'll always see me as, like, the guy who goes out first, but I'm never the brute, so I'm more like the, uh, soldier, the medium class soldier, that's what I like the mo using the most. And if you see my Bioshock LP, not Bioshock LP, but, um, Borderlands LP, if Cordell actually puts it out there, because Cordell has been editing it, and I, I know he's been editing it, but he needs to put it out. He hasn't uploaded it at all. And I need to send him all the infamous episodes I recorded. Uh, okay, that was the, the door over there, exploded, so we want to go back here. And you want to destroy these guys before they actually start attacking, if you're not good against them. And grab the gamma re regulator. Yeah, guess who that's for, guys? 
you if you don't uh, if you don't know, I'm sorry, but you um, this isn't a time to reference to go back to kindergarten because obviously kindergarten doesn't know who who that is for. But um, you should go back to uh, you should go back to school. Yeah, you should watch. You should watch all the Marvel movies. There you go. You should watch every single Marvel movie that's ever been made. Ever. Of all time. Like, ever. Every single one. I want you to watch it all. In one day. No excuses. I don't care that almost every single one of their movies is like two hours long. Or an hour and a half long. You have to watch every single one. Including the ones from the olden days. Okay. Like the Blade ones and the Punisher ones from back in the old days. No complaints. Why is there one of these already down here? Uh -oh. uh, I'm gonna add that because we have the Human Torch on our team. So instead of Versus Fire, I'm gonna add plus five fire. Even though it only helps one or only one character on our team. I don't understand why they actually made those if they only help one character on the team. Because literally, he is pretty much the only person who uses fire in the whole game. I don't... I can't honestly think of anyone at this time who also uses um, fire. Because only Iceman uses ice, only uh, the Human Torch uses fire, so... I don't see who else uses fire. I know who uses fire arms, but not fire. Um, yeah, I, I can't think of anyone who uses fire. I don't know. Maybe uh, Storm can use it. I mean, one of the combos... I know some of the combos use fire, but... And here's your next uh, audio clip, right there. From Bardis is uh, ordering order from the Tinker. Pretty much what that order was is um her telling him that he needs to hurry up and make the soldiers. But I gotta cut it off here. So this has been German One Two Three Five Six Seven Eight Nine. I'll see you guys next time on uh, Marvel Ultimate Alliance Two. See you guys.